every single, every single, every single Sunday. A lot of people think my dogs don't like doing every single Sunday dance, but she loves it. Actually, maybe not Kaz. Maybe Kaz doesn't like it because he's just too big and awkward and doesn't like being held. And this one loves being held and she smells like pee again. But anyways, let's get started with the Q&A. First question is from that boy, Al3X. What is the greatest feeling of your life? Being happy with this one. Mine is being inside this one. No, that's really slutty, babe. You can't do slutty stuff like that. Also killing the whole enemy team in trials. I think I like that more. Next question is from William. How long have you been playing video games? I've been playing video games since I was six years old. My dad got me a PlayStation 1 when I was six, and me and my brother would always play, and I would be player one, and he would be player two, and I kind of just grew up with PlayStation. Then I got a PlayStation 2, and then PlayStation 3, and then 4. And I've been at it for 17 years now. Next question is from Austin Reynolds. What Call of Duty setting do you want next? Let's put it in space, because why the hell not? I have a feeling if they put it in space, it'd be either like Destiny or Advanced Warfare. I feel like they're trying to make COD as much as like Destiny as possible. I mean, I'm just kidding. I don't think it should be in space. I would prefer an old style COD with modern combat. It would be nice to have a COD like Modern Warfare 3, because I haven't played something like that in so long. I mean, that's just what I think. Stop making future games! Thank you. Next question is from Ali14. Would you rather get drunk out of your mind or just chill and get high? Dude, I'm assuming you are 14 based on your name and your picture, and you shouldn't be asking me this because one, I don't get drunk out of my mind, and two, I don't get high. Despite what some of you guys think. Because some of you guys see me on stream and you're like, oh my god, she is high again. She is drinking again. But no, sometimes I just get like naturally high. And you guys assume it's drugs or alcohol or something, but it's not. I'm 23 and I've never done a drug and I I have never got drunk out of my mind. So honestly, I'd rather chill and eat. Eat, watch a movie, Netflix and eat. I like eating a lot, a little too much. That's literally all I do whenever I wanna do something fun, whenever Sausage wants to go do something fun, we just go eat. It's a problem. Next question is from It's Kapow. If Donald Trump gets elected, will you move to Canada? Assuming that I'm gonna get kicked out, I'm probably gonna get kicked out, yeah. I mean, I am an immigrant. I came here, I was on a green card for half my life. And then people voted for this motherfucker, he's gonna kick me out. Next question is from Enrique Garcia. Do you wear contacts? I normally don't wear contacts, I just prefer to put on glasses, but sometimes I do wear them. They're just normally really, really hard to put in. So I suck at it. That's what she said. Next question is from Jude Holm. What is the subject you hated most at school? I absolutely despised chemistry. Like it made me hate my life. And what's really ironic is that all my classes were like chemistry classes because I was going to school for pharmacy. So I had to take all the chemistry classes and they really, really suck. It's like math. It's really, really, really hard math. And I am not very good at math. So I suck at chemistry. Next question is from Sherilyn Morales. Can you do a back bend? I've been practicing my yoga and this is one of the things I do to help my back hurt less than it usually does. I've been having really bad back problems where I always have to like stretch it and like crack it. I don't know if that's good for it. Cracking is probably not that good, but I do it anyway because it feels good. Next question is from Factions P-U-G. Have you ever considered getting a pug instead of a palmeridane? But Sausage actually likes pugs. I am not too crazy about pugs. I know PewDiePie has two pugs and they're really cute, but I just like Pomeranians. And pugs have like that smooshed in face and they always look sad and worried. Next question is from Destiny as Light. Are you hyped for the new update for Destiny? Yes, they are finally adding new things. Yes, I've been waiting months for this. Like the game's been dead for so long and now people are finally gonna get back on it because they're putting new stuff. They're finally bringing back Lucky Raspberry so I can use my Hunter again and now they're bringing year two of it and they are bringing back the Shadow Prize. That's probably gonna be really good. Year two Thorn. I'm just kidding, but I got a Thorn in real life and I love it so much. I actually got this for Sausage's birthday. Next question is from Johnny V. Which Final Fantasy VII remake scene are you really looking forward to? Eris' death. I am super excited to see Steph Roth and Vincent. They used to be my imaginary boyfriends when I was growing up, so... I'm excited to see them in HD. <laughs> Next question is from Jaylon. Would you poop on John Cena's face for 15 million? <laughs> what kind of question is this? Dude, seriously? <laughs> Who wouldn't poop on John Cena's face? for 15 million. I would even take 15 million pesos. 15 million anything. Poop on your face. I'd poop all over you. He'd poop on anybody's face for I'd 15 million. I'd poop all million. over you for a dollar. Honestly, I would too. I think everybody watching this video would poop on anybody's face for 15 million. 
Let's be real. Next question is from Pyro Celtic. How did you tell your parents you were quitting school to do YouTube? How did they react at first? I was in college when I dropped out and I didn't drop out just to do YouTube. YouTube was something I was doing on the side. I mostly dropped out to run my own business, work on it. I wanted to move out and get an apartment and make money. I decided to take a year off of school, work on everything else. I managed to move out of my parents' house. I got my own apartment. I was doing really good. So I just decided to not go back to school, at least for now. School is something that you can always go back to. Next question is from Finn. Would you ride on a donkey? P.S. I love you. P.S. I love you too. And I always ride on a donkey. No. No, that's not what donkeys say. No. That's not what donkeys say. They look at all ocean and get off. Next question is from Buddy Boy 34 How do you fix a messed up sleep schedule? I was a victim of messed up sleep schedule for far too long, but I finally fixed it. I mean, I am waking up at 10 a.m., sometimes 11, but for the most part, 10 a.m. every day, and that's very good for me because I used to wake up at 2 p.m. Whenever I would travel somewhere, I would just fly in that afternoon and have my video scheduled and uploaded for the next day so I'm not up until like 6 a.m. working on a video. That's what really gets me because I'm always up at night procrastinating. Whenever I stay up to edit, I procrastinate way longer than I should. Whenever I work on videos in the morning, I just get it done really quick. No procrastination, no nothing. So it's better to do all your work in the morning as soon as you wake up instead of waiting till midnight to do it. I mean, that's how I fix mine. Next question is from Lol Cheese Poop. Do you actually have eyesight problems or do you wear glasses to look sexy? I don't wear glasses to look sexy or for attention. I actually can't see far range. I can't really see very far away or from a certain distance. Like things start to get blurry sometimes. And yes, my glasses are a prescription. A lot of people don't like how I wear my glasses either. They're like, you should wear them like this. You wear them too low. They actually rest on my nose because I have a ridge on my nose that they like to rest on. So this is more comfortable for me than wearing them up here where it's really awkward and they're touching my eyebrows and they're touching my eyelashes. So I wear them like this. Next question is from Dora Gonzalez. Have you ever thought about getting an R8 car? They are legit pro mate. One car, I never understood why people like it is the R8. It's just I feel like it's so boring and plain and does not look like a supercar or a nice car to me. It just looks like the Audi Twin Turbo. But no, there's so many other cars I'd rather have than an R8. Next question is from Christina Torres. Have you ever been catfished? P.S. Love you, girl. P.S. Love you, too. And yes, I was catfished because Sausage catfished me. He sent me pics of some other guy saying it was him. And then he showed me what he really looked like. And I was like, oh, this boy is cute. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and the 50,000 50, likes on this video. And if you have any questions for me for next week's episode, make sure you comment them below. I read all of your questions.